If you've ever gotten an error message in Python that left you scratching your head, you're not alone. Today, I'll show you five of the weirdest errors in Python. Errors that look confusing, but are easy to solve once you know what's going on. Let's break down each error with code examples and fixes. Let's start with one of the most infamous errors, indentation error, unexpected indent. This error appears when you accidentally add extra spaces or tabs where Python doesn't expect them. Python relies on indentation to understand code structure, so even a single space can cause this error. To fix this, make sure your lines are indented consistently. Check for any extra spaces or mismatched tabs. Here's the corrected version. Next up, syntax error, invalid syntax. This error is vague, but usually means Python encountered something it doesn't recognize. Common causes? A missing parenthesis, colon, or incorrect character somewhere in your code. To solve this, check if you missed any characters. In this example, I forgot a colon after the if statement. Here's the corrected code. This one's strange. Type error, none type object is not subscriptable. This usually happens when you try to index or slice a variable that's actually none. It's common if you accidentally overwrite a list or string with none. Here, I used append on my list which doesn't return a new list but modifies the original. This means my list now equals none. To fix this, just remove my list mask so append doesn't replace the variable. Next, the dreaded index error, list index out of range. This means you're trying to access an index that doesn't exist in your list, like going too far forward or backward. To fix this, make sure you're only accessing indexes within the list's length. Use len to check how many items you have or adjust your indexing. Last but not least, the key error. This happens when you try to access a dictionary key that doesn't exist. It's one of those frustrating errors that's easy to miss. To fix a key error, you can use get instead of directly accessing keys. Get returns none if the key doesn't exist, avoiding the error. Or check within to confirm if the key is there first. So there you have it, five of the weirdest Python errors and how to tackle them. Remember, these errors may seem confusing, but with a bit of patience, you can fix them quickly and keep coding smoothly. If you enjoyed this, hit subscribe and turn on notifications. Comment below with any strange errors you've encountered and I'll break them down in future videos. Thanks for watching and keep coding.